Hi guys, hope you're all doing good. Uh, this is our recent DIY project, best out of waste, all-in-one game board which I made for my little one. Uh, actually, four games in one, as you can see. Uh, there is a ball slider in the left, and then you have a ball track and marble run. Plus, I have made an uh, basketball shoot-up game. I'll just uh, brief you on how I did it. Uh, so this is uh, best out of waste project as I've told you actually my neighbor was going to discard this 55 inch uh, TV box and I got it from her thinking I can do something useful for my four year old. I've cut the front portion the front panel of the board as you can see the front part I've cut and I've used to make this uh, ball sliders so I have made six ball sliders and uh, it slides down and gets collected at the bottom in the basket so for the ball slider um, I just bent a portion of the slider and I have uh, secured it to the side of the board using ropes same way uh, poking a hole using a compass or any sharp pointer just tied to the side and uh, to give it uh, support at the bottom I have used the uh, bottle caps and holes and uh, secured it at the, at the back side so for each slider you can see I have used a bottle cap at the bottom to give it the right slope and uh, to the left I have attached it to the uh, side uh, using the rope so that's it. and uh, same with the ball ball track for ball track I've used the uh, milk bottles the bigger bottles it passes through the bottles like a tunnel and comes out here I used the cello tapes to first check out if the flow is smooth and all that. Kept them in position and then I poked two holes and I've knotted behind the board. I'll show you behind the end. So uh, for each bottle I have uh, used uh, ropes to tie it at either ends. And then you have the marble, marble run. For that I've used these small bottles. This is the top uh, part of the bottle and I have uh, used a uh, tissue roll here and I have inserted the bottle opening here so that the marble can pass through this and the bigger bottle as you can see I have made two holes so it can pass through the bottle come down into this and then um, through this. Uh, you can use the tissue ro uh, roll here I have used the case that I uh, had with seed pencils and uh, it comes out through the net and gets collected in the coconut shell so we'll just see how it goes so slides like this For the marble run, it goes like this. Basketball shooter. Uh, for the ring, I have used the uh, bucket that you get along with the uh, dosa batter. I have uh, cut the top portion to make that basketball ring. And this is the net uh, that you get with onions. If you don't have this, you can uh, use a plastic cover or any cloth as well. This one is a paper cup and I have cut the bottom of the paper cup um, and I have uh, put the balloon, just knotted the balloon and uh, uh, cut the bottom part of the balloon, inserted it, kept a ball so you can pull and leave it to make the ball shoot up so that uh, you can shoot it up into the basket and it just goes, falls into the same bottle cup and it comes down to the bottom. This is the back side of the box full of knots. Uh, since no glue is used, you can remove the parts and you can use it for uh, doing some other activity later. So that's it. So these are the four games in one. The ball slider, ball track, marble run and the basketball shoot up. All done using uh, um, available items at home. Um, so you can also try it. Uh, as I told you, I have used uh, TV's box. Uh, so I was able to make this design. You can use any box 
uh, which is available and uh, plan accordingly uh, it can even accommodate two more slides if uh, I can move it just a bit <laughs> According to your box size and using your creativity, you can try out different techniques. Hope you liked our uh, idea and I think this is a perfect game for this uh, lockdown. Sir are at home, they will surely enjoy such uh, uh, ball uh, games, shoot up games. So, uh, do try it and uh, let me know how you uh, did it and how your kid loved it. So do like and share this video and please remember to subscribe to our channel for more such activities and DIY projects. Thank you.